Today we're gonna to be talking all about cash envelopes and how I make these cool cash envelopes at home. Hi, I'm Kamiko from The Budget Mom. Come along with me as I strive to live a life I love on a budget that I can afford. Welcome to The Budget Mom YouTube channel. Today we're gonna to be doing a full video tutorial that will show you how I make my cash envelopes at home. I get a lot of questions on how do I make these, you know, what products do I use, what paper do I use, what glue I, do I use, so I thought it would be fun to give you that step-by-step -step tutorial on how I make these. I like to create and design new cash envelopes with every single paycheck. It's an element of fun that I've added along the way on my budgeting journey. I use two different types of cash envelopes. I use a vertical envelope that looks like this. It has a spending tracker on the back to update my cash spending as I go along, and I have a vertical envelope that looks like this. Now these are reusable. I use an index card inside of these to keep track of my cash spending. There is no spending tracker. You can literally use these over and over and over again as long as you'd like. So I'm gonna be showing you how I make bo both of these cash envelopes in today's video tutorial. I try sharing my story to remind readers that there is a way out. That with hard work, dedication, determination, motivation, it's all about having a plan for your money. And that's what gives you the true control. Holy crap, it just changed my life. We're like, oh man, Nico. It takes time, it takes dedication, it takes work. No more credit card debt. So today I'm going to be showing you how to make my horizontal cash envelopes as well as my vertical cash envelopes. This is what it looks like when you just print them out. It's literally like a template. So first let me show you the different types of accessories or products that I use to make my cash envelopes. The glue that I use to make my horizontal cash envelopes is this zip dry paper glue. It dries super super fast. Um, it was recommended to me by a, sca a scrapbooking friend. She said it's wonderful. I've used it for the last year and a half on my envelopes and it works really, really well. For my vertical envelopes, I use just regular clear packing tape. And the paper that I like to print my envelopes on is this premium bright white 28 pound inkjet laser paper. So that's the, different, that's the type of paper that I like to use. It's 28 pound weight paper. When you're done making these, they're gonna look like this. So with the, we're gonna start with the horizontal cash envelopes first. What you need to do is literally just cut along the color design. should look like this. The first thing that I do is I like to fold the flaps in and on each one of these envelope templates I do give you folding lines so there's a line that will show you where you need to fold the envelope but I like to start with the tabs so then it will look like this. The next thing that you need to do is fold up the bottom. And once again, there is a fold line right down here on the bottom on where you need to fold. And then it will look like this. The next thing I like to do is I like to fold the top in. And once again, you're just folding along the white line and you have your horizontal cash envelope made. Now all you have to do is glue it together. For that, I like to fold it apart like this. I take my glue and I just fold along, or I just glue along the tabs. Doesn't have to be a lot of glue, just a little to get it to hold. And because the glue dries so fast, you, you don't have to hold it very long, just a couple of seconds. 
and I would let this sit for about a minute and these are good to go. So that's how you make the horizontal cash envelopes. For the vertical envelopes, it starts out looking like this, just a template. You want to do the same thing and cut along the color design. So once you cut out your vertical cash envelope, it will look like this. Now with the vertical cash envelopes, you don't need the glue. All you need is the packing tape. So I do the same thing. I start off with folding the flaps in. And once again, these also have a gray line folding lines for you to fold on. So then you have your cash envelope that looks like this. The next thing that I like to do is folding up the bottom. And once again, there's a fold line that you know where to fold your paper. And your, your cash envelope is made. Now what I do with these is I just take a little bit of packing tape. And I place the tape right on the where I folded the paper. And then I do the same thing along the bottom. So then you have your vertical cash envelope. The great thing, like I said, with the vertical cash envelopes is you can make these or reuse these as many times as you want. You can make the horizontal cash envelopes as many times as you want. You'll just have to print out a new one once you fill up the spending trackers. But because the vertical cash envelopes, does, they don't have a spending tracker, you're using an index card. These can be reused multiple times. I'll put links to the products that I use in the description of this video, but I use the zip dry paper glue, some clear packing tape for the vertical envelopes, and then I do use that premium 28 pound bright white inkjet paper. I get mine at Staples, but you can find them in a lot of different office supply stores. And like I said, I'll go ahead and put links to all of these different types of products in the description of this video. If you found this video helpful, please share it and don't forget to subscribe.